Hey gents, today I'm finally unboxing the last of my pending Made to Measure shirts. Before the roundup, I'm going to do Alton Lane and Lin Yeti together, a little economies of scale here. Alton Lane, I spent some time at last summer in New York. This was delivered, uh, I don't want to say, at some point last year. And Lin Yeti, uh, a little bit quicker, I just got it delivered last week. And so I'm gonna unbox these, try them on. These will complete the current list for the Made to Measure dress shirt roundup so I can put that together and get all my thoughts together because really it's from a price point of like $30 up to uh, so my suit supply shirt, my suit supply made to measure shirt was up at like 220 or something like that. So I'm going to talk about both of these, try them on, unbox them, talk about the experience because Lin Yeti, I got measured at one of their ateliers and at Alton Lane, I was measured by their 3D body scanner at their place in New York and the benefits between each of them. So let's unbox them, make sure you subscribe to learn more about cool brands like this and give a thumbs up for custom dress shirts. Here we go. All right, a little bit of a time warp here. That intro video I actually shot a year ago, and so like the Alton Lane shirt, eagle-eyed viewers will know, I've worn this shirt in other videos. I still haven't finished the roundup guide, but I'm trying, you know, I just keep adding brands, and I'm trying to create the most comprehensive made-to-measure shirt guide on the internet, so patience there is very appreciated, but I still wanted to give the time to talk to each of these shirts. So Alton Lane and Lin Yeti, I've actually had over a year with both of them as well, so I've been able to kind of feel them out and then I want to talk about their process. So with Alton Lane, the only way you used to be able to buy Alton Lane shirts, especially when I shot that intro video, where well, you had to go to a showroom. Since then, they've added a few different options. You can now buy a shirt as a gift. You can also talk to somebody. They'll essentially walk you through the measurement process over the phone. You can actually mail in a perfect fitting shirt and they will replicate the fit for you, or of course going into their showrooms. A note about the showrooms is that they actually don't rely as heavily on the body scanner. I think when they first launched, that was a big thing, like they would scan your body. But what I've learned as I've talked to other made to measure shirt companies and people in the industry in the last 18 months, is that the body scanners actually don't give you that good of a fit. When I went to Alton Lane, they actually measured my physical body entirely and then they were basically done and I asked about the body scanner and they said, oh yeah, we can also do the body scanner, but they mostly rely on the measurements done in the showroom. And so the Alton Lane shirt, the reason you see some of the higher prices is not only because they have showrooms and they need to support staff that are within there, but they also use very high quality materials and I can feel that in the shirt, but also the fit they absolutely nailed. So this is right the box and then they will offer that you can go back in for alterations via them which are included alterations and that's the way that you see companies cutting costs in other ways like if you want to buy a made to measure shirt for 60 bucks you could probably get one but they're not going to include alterations and then the experience isn't quite as seamless as with Alton Lane so if you live near an Alton Lane shop I think Alton Lane is a great option to go with because with all these made to measure companies you get the best experience in the store and actually I'm seeing a little bit of the a little bit of pulling um, in the video right here, but it's actually, this is one of my favorite fitting shirts, and I like the pattern that I chose as well. Looks, you know, nice stiff collar, which helps it underneath a blazer or the tie. Looks great, and so the Alton Lane shirt is really good, and I really like the design of the Alton Lane one, the way that it comes down and kind of flares, so I get the nice body taper, but it flares enough down here that it doesn't feel tight and constricted, and they have this nice section here, so. Really liking that. And then talking about Lin Yeti's shirt as well, I went into my profile and the shirt that I ordered was based on my in-home measurements, not the ones that I had taken at the store. And so 
The Lanyetti shirt fits just, you know, it fits the same really nice form-fitting feel. It's exactly the slimness that I want. The neck is perfect. The sleeve is well done. And they also are another one that use premium Italian fabrics and all their stuff is made in Italy. And so that's why you're seeing slightly higher prices with Lanyetti. And it's nice with these companies like Alton Lane, you can get a suit for $5,000 or a suit for $1,000 depending on the fabrics that you choose, but also your measurements are based on their profile system. It just depends on, you know, do you want the in-person experience with Alton Lane or do you want the Italian made, you know, heritage style experience with Lignetti and then it comes down to the fabrics they choose as well because really when it comes to fit of the clothing it is down to you. Do you want a European style or something a little bit wider and that comes down to the measurements that you give when you're building that profile. And you see this on brands that have lower prices on their shirts, they'll upcharge you for monograms, whereas with Lignetti and Alton Lane, I did a monogram on my torso, which is the Italian traditional placement for a monogram, as I'm told, and then Alton Lane, I just put one in the collar as well, because I always like to see the little JJS there. So I just wanted to give an update on the shirt roundup, Alton Lane, Lignetti, you know, I buy all these shirts and I wanna make sure that I get the information out there, so apologies for de the delay. And if you have any questions about both of them, I've gone through the experience. I'm actually gonna go get some more stuff from Alton Lane very soon. Lignetti, I'm ordering some of their custom polos and so I'm still trying to explore these options. You know, when I started this, when I started my channel, I thought I could cover all the brands that were out there, but I, I had a feeling the space would explode, but I had no idea that it would be just the explosion in brands since 2015 is truly incredible. Um, and so it's a little bit overwhelming as I try to cover all of them. But Lignetti, Alton Lane, slightly higher prices, but great experiences, great fabrics, great quality. So you pay for them. And so if, again, any questions, love to answer them down below in the comments. You can also reach out as always on social media. Until next time, gents, this is The Cavalier.